a ring door camera capturing the terror that a San Antonio man with a violent criminal history let loose on a Stone Oak neighborhood on Sunday. The man banging on the back window of a door and threatening to start shooting if they didn't let him inside. And that's not all. Our Daniela Ibarra with the video and a frightened homeowner who watched it all unfold live. This video gives Lisa Sin chills. It still feels like a nightmare. On Sunday, Sin watched on her phone as this man strolls up to her door, gun in hand. Her kids hid inside their Stone Oak home alone. I was just praying, 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 praying that he wouldn't do anything. Didn't hurt my kids. Take my stuff. I don't care, but don't hurt my kids. 34-year-old Christopher Rodriguez is accused of terrorizing several neighbors in Summer Glen. Actually, one of our neighbors picked him up in the back of his truck and took him outside of the community. An incident report from the Bear County Sheriff's Office says that neighbor drove Rodriguez to the nearby Canyon Springs golf course. The report says Rodriguez pulled a gun on the neighbor, telling him, quote, he had two choices and that neither of them were good. Rodriguez, who was out on parole, has a violent criminal history dating back more than 15 years. Just last week, BCSO began investigating after a woman accused Rodriguez of punching her while Rodriguez drove a car and then at the couple's apartment. Assaults, according to BCSO, that took place in front of a newborn baby. That same woman told deputies Rodriguez tortured and killed her cat in front of her in May. This guy has a rap sheet a mile long. There's no reason why he should have been on the streets in the first place. While Rodriguez is now in custody, Sin says her family struggles to feel safe. We're all a little traumatized right now. Danielle Ibarra, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.